All right, Coach Miller here, and we're thanking Powertrain for letting us use their gym up in Rockville, Maryland. If you guys want to get any personalized training, hit me up. I'll put you in touch with Tyler. But what I'm going to do is take you through a lacrosse post-practice circuit right now. We're going to hit kind of like a total body workout, and we're going to start over here on the incline. This bar right here is called the football bar. That's what we call it. It's pretty cool. You can have all sorts of different grips and stuff. So we're going to do incline bench. Like always, I'll put all the repage. I want you doing a quarter at the bottom. So you're going to come down nice and slow on a three count. Three, two, one, quarter, up. We're going to go eight reps. Three, two, one, quarter, up, two, three, two, one, quarter, up, three. Yeah, just kind of walk around. Three, two, one. Three. I'm going to do two more reps here. Three, two. Three, two, one. All right, from there, we're going to come over here. We're going to hit our neck. A lot of people forget about hitting the neck, but the neck's really important because it helps prevent concussions, especially in lacrosse. And it, you know, all around makes you pretty stronger from the shoulders down to your chest. So this here is just like a, a little harness, a neck harness thing that you put, you strap around your head. I have the incline bench all the way. It's high, pretty much, you know, just had a, you know, pretty steep incline. And you come over here, you brace your, your chest against a the bench, then you just come up, go down nice and slow, come all the way up. This is an awesome exercise, really helps prevent concussions. You should hit your neck at least once a week. So with this post-practice circuit, we're gonna make sure that we address our neck. We're gonna do three rounds of this. Pretty much go until failure. For me, it's around 10, 12 reps with the, uh, the weight I have selected there. Okay, from there, we're gonna come over here. We're gonna hit our glutes. This machine right here is kind of the 45 degree back extension. So here you're gonna, you know, get it, get into the machine you want this to be level with your hip, so you can adjust it however you want. You adjust it right down here with this thing. Down here, you want your toes being straight down. You don't want your toes to flare out. You can do this one-legged or two-legged. Right now, I'm gonna show you two-legged. You want your gaze, when you come up, to be straight. You want to be gazing down. You don't want your, tell your head up like this. You're gonna be coming down like this, coming up like that. All right, we're gonna do 10 reps. But you're gonna hold it for two seconds at the top, really squeeze your glutes and your butt together. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten. You're really gonna feel it in there. It's an awesome, awesome exercise. Okay, so next up, I want you getting a pretty light weight. This is only like 10 pounds, so it's kind of wide. I learned this in my boxing workouts. You're gonna put the, put the, the plate above your head Put a little out in front, you're gonna get full body rotation. Really letting your body be loose. Letting the weight come all the way around. Bring it in front of you and all as far back as you can go. Again, as big a circles as possible. This is gonna help prevent injuries. It's gonna help you have better mobility. I want you doing 10. 
each way. This one feels awesome. I just learned about it. So I wanted to show you guys right away. All right, in the fifth exercise, we're just gonna come over here on the lat pull down machine. I want us getting a quarter at the bottom and then you're gonna come up real slow on a three count. So we're gonna come down, pause, quarter, up, three, two, one. 12 reps. Quarter, three, two, one. Quarter, three, two, one. Quarter, three, two, one. Quarter, three, two, one. So I just showed you a few reps right there, but I'm gonna have you do 12. So I'm gonna have you go through this five exercise circuit three times. So we'll do three rounds. It should only take you 25 to 30 minutes, you can bang it out. So that means you can get this post-practice lacrosse circuit in, no problem, after circuit, so you can get the weight room in, hit the neck, hit your upper body, hit your glutes. It'll be awesome, get some mobility work in. I'll keep on showing you some more, but get this in at your next practice or after your next practice, so you can make sure you're hitting all the necessary stuff in the weight room. Coach Miller, talk soon. All right, real quick, if you're looking to go a little bit deeper, then I got two things for you. First, get on my email list. I send out emails a few times a week with videos, articles, and stuff to keep you motivated to help you become a better lacrosse player. And second, check out the link right here to check out all my online programs from all comprehensive to skill development training to shooting to specific stuff like being a two-way player, stuff like that. All right, talk soon.